What's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and in today's video I want to talk about Destiny's future and the new content which in my opinion Destiny really needs to save itself. At the moment for me Destiny is at an all time low. Now this has nothing to do with others that still play the game or even the amount that still grind every day. I just mean for me and for me is a game that ain't offering much at the moment. Challenge mode? I did kind of hope it would restore a little bit of faith, but it ain't. And to be honest guys, it was kind of a letdown to what I thought it was going to be, but that's just me. And really that's just me being an idiot and overhyping shit. But to be honest, I can't really blame myself as I'm just in a state of mind with Destiny that anything new I hear about gets me all excited and shit. So I do in general overhype things, but in all honesty Destiny for me at the moment is dry and playing it just don't feel right as of what I'm doing I've done and don't really need to do. You know what people, I haven't even run the raid in over a month, that's how crazy shit's gone. Even with challenge mode, I ran up to Warpriest and stopped on all three characters. And what makes playing Destiny at the moment even worse is the other great games that have just come out. Maybe this as a time where Destiny is dry is actually a good thing as so many new games have just come out. I think Bungie knew about this and I think they chose not to try and compete as it would have been kind of dangerous. Look at it from Bungie's point of view. Bungie knew at this time of year that many new releases were coming out and a major part of their player base will be playing new games and I feel they were being really smart about it. For sure the hardcore players such as myself who basically has only played Destiny for the past year will feel a little disappointed at how dry it is at the moment and will find it even harder to move on to new games but in all honesty it isn't a bad move to move on and try other games. Bungie knows this too, at the end of the day there was this new influx of games coming. They could have chose to try and compete by like maybe releasing a new DLC and trying to keep their players playing Destiny even with all these new games rolling out or they could have done the smart thing which is what they've done. I mean them not trying to compete in my opinion was the right move as look at it this way, people will be moving on to play new games and I ain't saying they would never come back, it's just games like Black Ops 3, Star Wars and Fallout are all hard to resist and some games people were playing before Destiny and no matter what Bungie did people would still take time out of Destiny to play these other titles. Bungie staying in the shadows here is a smart move on their behalf. Taking a back seat and waiting for the right time before announcing and dropping new DLC was a great call. Letting us have fun with other games before hitting us with new content is really really smart. Dropping DLC while other games are being released left, right and centre will only result in people less interested in what they have to offer in terms of DLC and new content. Them waiting is the right call and yeah for sure for the hardcore player it's not what we want. We want DLC every damn week but it ain't going to be the case so stop dreaming. So when will we get in this new content? I believe something will be announced at PSX this weekend. I just have a feeling Bungie have something amazing in the bag which will get us all excited to play it again for all the people that ain't excited already. But is this just me overhyping shit as this is what we all need and want? Well we'll find out pretty soon. But guys that is the end of the video, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, do drop a like, I do appreciate the support, tell me your thoughts on Destiny and its current state down below in that comment section and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out until next time. Peace! We all on YouTube every damn day, watching these vids of the brand new games. Vid after vid, many are the same, that's why you gotta go and find DPJ. Destiny gameplay.